guys, it's Melissa. In this video, I am going to show you how to do some quick daily maintenance on your Prestige A3 DTF printer. So this can get a little intimidating. I have said before that the DTF printer seems to be one of the ones in my office, in my workspace that I have, that is the most high maintenance as far as uh, maintenance. However, you can make this a pretty quick process um, on the daily. So this, when I say daily, I mean production day. So if you're printing, this is what you want to do. Um, three steps I'm going to show you from checking the waste tank to making sure that your uh, print head and uh, your print head is clean. All right, so let's get started. I gotta move the camera so you can see what I'm doing. And again, top three things you wanna check every day you print with your Prestige A3 DTF printer. All right, before you can perform any maintenance, you do need to make sure that your printer is on. So turn the power on and you wanna make sure that you wait until the green light becomes solid. So if your printer hasn't been on and that light is flashing, as you can see mine is now, you need to wait until um, the green light becomes solid. Once that green light turns solid, then you wanna hit that middle button on the front of your printer, and that is the maintenance button. So that will put it into maintenance mode. Now, it appears as if this should light up, but it doesn't, so don't worry. But what you can hear is the print head will be moving back and forth, okay? Once it stops moving, then you can open up this top lid, all right? Then what you wanna do while you're in maintenance mode is you can manually move this print head to the middle. You're gonna have to use a little bit of you know, arm muscle there to move that. Now, this exposes two of the areas that we want to clean on a daily basis after using the machine. So one is this area right here where ink may be gathering, and the other is this area down here it, where we can't see it quite yet, but we are going to expose the wiper. Both of them can be cleaned with the cleaning solution, okay? So you wanna put a little bit of cleaning solution on the tip of a swab, and then you are just going to clean this area right here to try to remove any excess ink that might have gathered, okay? So you can see my swab has some ink on there, all right? So this is just something you can do very quickly. Now, the second thing that we wanna do is get that wiper. So the wiper is attached to this little white thing. You can see this small gray area in front of it. We need to flip it up. In order to do that, you're gonna come over here and compress this, and you see how it moves this whole area? So if you can do that with one hand and then use your other hand to open up to push the wiper back, okay? So this right here is the wiper, this whole gray part, and we wanna clean that. So again, you can use your, use your um, swab with the cleaning solution to clean that, all right? And then, because what you don't want, you can see I got a lot of stuff off there. What you don't want is for ink to get um, caked on there because it won't print correctly. Then get one of your little towels that comes with the cleaning and gently wipe the wiper clean. So again, this is gonna help make sure that you have good prints. Now, once that's completely clean, as you can see mine pretty much is, you are then going to make sure that you push the wiper back down how it was. So again, compress this whole side to the, to the right and then you can gently push this down, all right? So now you're all set here. So we can now close the front of the machine and go to the back to check the waste, um, man, the waste um, container. And if it's full, we'll wanna empty that and that's the third part of this. You wanna make sure that the tube that is going in is not touching the um, ink that's in there. And if it is, then you wanna make sure that you empty this waste container. It doesn't need to be emptied until, you know, it's a, it, this is about good to be emptied, to be honest with you. But you definitely wanna make sure that the tube, the tip of the tube that's in there is not down into the liquid. So that's it, it's just those three things that you are going to definitely want to check on a daily basis after you print. If you end up having printing problems where a color's not printing correctly or colors 
um, are not coming out of the, the um, print head as you would expect. Then you will want to take a few additional steps to do nozzle checks um, and a print head cleaning. But otherwise, on the daily, after printing, just those three things. Clean that area where ink can uh, clean, uh, collect clean the wiper, and check the waste tank, all right? All right, you guys, if you're looking for more videos on how to use the Prestige DTF printer, I've got a lot, so check them out. And if you're looking for the best bundles, if you're looking for supplies, if you're looking for free film for your DTF printer, I've got that as well.